Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be reacting or recreating my first ever makeup tutorial that I put on this channel which was two years ago now. I've had a quick watch of it just to see whether I've got any of the products or anything like that. Um, I was so awkward and I did not know how to do my makeup properly so I really hope you guys enjoy this video. If you want to see what I do then just keep watching guys. I've got my laptop just down here. Video is called Everyday Makeup Routine and it has 160 views which is one of my most viewed videos on the channel and I put it up on the 4th of April 2018 so yeah let's play it and see how I was. Hey guys it's Rosie and today I thought to do my Everyday Makeup Routine uh, and hope I ran off enough to try and do that. I'm so awkward. <laughs> I don't have that moisturiser anymore so I'm just going to go in with my usual Body Shop Drops of Light moisturiser just before I continue on because I cannot do my makeup without a little bit of moisturiser. Right, let's see what I let's see what I did next. Mm -hmm. I don't have that anymore so I'm going to use the Precisely My Brow pencil from Benefit in number 2 which pretty much does exactly the same thing. I'm so Just brushing them through. Okay. Ah, this is snapped. So because in that video I said that I use a pomade if I want a bit more of a dramatic brow, I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pomade in top. Let's just look like that. Let's see how I do these things. So I just brush them through with my spoolie and then use the pencil. I literally stop my brow there. And I'll bring it out to here just because I think it looks a bit better. But you know, we've got to do it how how I used to do it back then. This is gonna be awful. It's already. Oh my god, I hate this so much. It's literally hard for me to even like try and do my makeup how I used to, just because. I've learned so much in the last two years, and I've changed up my makeup routine so so much since then. There we go, that is the brows done. I hate it so much. Oh my god. Let's see, let's continue. So I used to set them using a clean mascara. I generally don't own any clean mascara anymore so I'm just gonna go in with the Benefit 3D brow tones in number two just to set them. I'm just going to do that now. They looked so bad. Like, I couldn't even make them look that bad now. I'm going to go into some crazy hair. Yes, do. What I do. Look like caterpillars. In the back of my dinky hair. I do the tattoo right there. Around the back of my hair. Like that. And then I take. <coughs> This is the expert concealer brush. And I'm just going to carve out my brows. I literally used to go all the way around and then down the middle as well. So I'm just going to do that now. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Alright, now that the brows are done and they look awful, I'm going to just continue on and see what I do next. I use the same one. Still. I do an entire pump for one cheek. That's 
gonna look so cakey. Right, let's go. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can't brush. I no longer use a brush to buff in foundation because I feel like it goes really, really streaky, but let's do it. This is also really hard because I haven't used it since like 2000, like literally since this video. So let's see. God, I hope you can this. It's gone so streaky. Oh, this is going so streaky. Now oh, my face is looking extremely streaky. Let's, uh, let's continue, shall we? I didn't even show like what I actually did with that but I've got that angled brush as well and I'm just gonna blend that in I would never use a brush now for this I'd always use a sponge oh my god that just went so patchy around my eye I actually ran out of that and I bought this instead which is the NARS uh, Light Reflecting Setting Powder Loose in Translucent so I'm just going to use this instead And then a big fluffy brush for the rest of my face. Just to use any setting spray or anything, which is the bit that's sort of worrying me the most because I used like my face used to look very, very cakey and very powdery. Because I used to just go ham with the powder. Like I can't even do that now. My face would just not forgive me, like ever, if I did that. My god. There is the base. All done, let's see what I do next. Eyeshadow? I know I use these two shades here. Which is sourced and low glow there. Use them in the crease. And I know that I used Maiden. didn't even like blend it out or up at all I literally just placed it it's taking a fluffy brush take sauce and just literally place it oh what was I thinking even now I think I'm like taking it too far out but it's literally just because I can't like like how should I have There, that's one colour in and I think I used exactly the same brush for low glow which is the next colour I'm using and I'm just going to do exactly the same with that oh my god there we go and then I used a flat brush so only which I can find is bright green still from my last video I want it, uh, my heavy metals palette and I'm using Maiden which is this one here I'm just packing that on my lid oh my god these are so crumbly when you use a brush there we go and I never put anything on my lower lash line so that's eyeshadow done
I genuinely don't have any contouring products anymore, so I'm just going to use the Max Factor Bronze and Powder in number two bronze just to bronze up my face. But I know I bronze it exactly the same way as I used to. I think. I love how I just didn't edit like any awkward like silences out. I just left them. Nice to know, so nice to know. And they're going to bronze because I'm not going to use the bronzer shade. That one here. And where is it? Here. With an angle brush. Angle brush. Just bronze it across my face. Now, I never used to bronze my nose, which I do now. So this could go one or two ways. Just gonna bronze up. So I used to barely use any so like I said nothing on my nose great and then for blush I use blush. I ran out with that so I've chucked it out so I'm just gonna use my NARS orgasm blush which just looks like this and same angle brush. Same brush. And I never used to use very much, so I'll not put as much on as usual. And I also never used to put it on my nose, which I do now. That's the blush. I have got an over highlighter, but this is Star Island, which is the one I use now. I'm just going to use this instead of Glazed Donut because I don't know where I've put it. I absolutely love this. And I use. I've got the brush in my brush. Oh, yeah. Brush. Oh, yeah. Same brush. Oh my god. So I used to take this. And I used to literally dap it, tap it in the tiniest bit. And then up the sides here. And then I used to just take this brush and just highlight my entire nose with it. And then. I used to keep this ball with it as well. So. And then I just take this little brush, which I've used for ever, and I used to highlight under my brow, which I don't do anymore, and then my inner corners. Let's see what's next. I want to say hi. That's all good, isn't it? Mascara, I use the Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme Lash Multiplier Golden Mascara. That mascara dried out because it was. Years and years and years old, so I'm just gonna use my Happy Go Lash mascara, which gives exactly the same effect. And I, I know I do my makeup in like a really weird order, but this is how I like to do it. So stop you. I'm just doing mascara. So I only put mascara on my top lashes because I don't like the look of it. Just because I don't like the art. I like. No mascara on my bottom lashes. Oh my god. Okay. Just mascara on the top lashes. Wow. I look like a different person. And then let's keep going. On my bottom lashes. And finally, on my lips, I use a few all over my lips. I use a couple for a while now. Just to. I'm just gonna coat my lips in this then, I guess. I don't use Vaseline anymore. Until it really dies on my lips. Even though it'll be my history of the fact that mine is. And I'm going to use the Ulfa Longwear Lasting Lipstick, Liquid Lipstick, in number one. I don't have that lipstick anymore, but this is a very similar shade. This is the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte in Venus. I'm just going to use this instead of the Ulfa one since I don't have it anymore. There we go. As I said, that is the finished look. 
don't like it, I don't look like myself. So, yeah, that is the finished look, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what you'd like me to do next. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.